Real quick vid, just want you to be aware. I don't know how well that's gonna, there's a nail in there, but I don't know how long it'll stay. This piece of trim isn't even connected. Okay, I'll fix that in a sec. So, just so we know what we're dealing with, try to make it a quick video. See? Just so we know what we're dealing with here. See? And then there's these huge gaps that we need to be aware of that uh, I can stick my finger in there and it won't go any further in. So, see clear down here, that's, that's like a half of an inch. No kidding, that's, that's like a half of an inch and it won't go in any further. Sorry for the terrible video, but it should give you a little bit of an idea of what I'm talking about. Here's this here, see that won't go in any further. So to fill that, I think will be a great idea, but I may end up having to like put a strip of, like, anyway, I'll take care of it for you. Then the top of this door, what I'd encourage you to do, see that'll, that'll go in, but the door is too short. So what I would suggest is get another piece of this trim here, and that'll make that look tight. And uh, as you can see, lots of gaps here, see that? And then this is a gap that won't go in much further, but it's still springy. So I'm almost, I'm almost putting trim in again, you know what I'm saying? So you just have to be aware of what I'm working with so that we can, I can't guarantee that, you know, all this stuff is gonna come together perfectly. But when I am done, I can find an example. Should be as close to that tight and then no seam at all. Should look just beautiful. That's how I roll. Hi, Melanie. So there we go. That's, that's what I'm talking about. And then a few repairs, you know, here and there. All right.